hiring to pay for information that leads to an arrest in a recent assault case. Two employees of the O'Reilly's Auto Shop on Glensboro Road were tied up and robbed last night. LEX 18's Adam Weiner now with the latest. Lawrenceburg Police Detective returned to Glensboro Road today to take another look around. Last night, just as the shop was closing up, two masked men came and taped the arms and legs of two O'Reilly employees. The robbers then got away with cash. Word of the violent robbery as people who work in this area spooked, especially those who work late. And it's scary. It's a scary thought. Safety is the main thing. Um, I have three other girls that work with me also. Uh, there are many nights that we are here late. Maureen Bryant owns and runs Moe's Uppercuts, very close to last night's robbery. One thing that we did talk about this morning is think the things that we need to do to, to be prepared. And across the street, employees of another auto parts shop showed me that they too were reviewing their robbery policies to make sure everyone understands what to do if something similar were to happen to them. Covering the news in Anderson County, Adam Weiner, LEX 18 News. A state police canine unit was notified last night, but the heavy rain would have made the trail nearly impossible to follow. Now here's Dia Davidson with a look.